Welcome crafters! I have a quick craft for you today. How to do a crackle paint texture for this coastal frame. Don't forget to subscribe, it helps me create even more craft tutorials. First you will paint the entire frame or any surface you're doing this texture on with your background paint color. I have used wall paint and acrylic paint for the background and both work great. I am using an oceany blue color that I actually just got at the discount paint section of the hardware store, but this aquamarine color is really close to it if you want a similar color. Now for the crackle paint magic. After the background paint has completely dried, we will coat the frame with Elmer's glue and then paint. I also poured the paint onto a tray first so I wouldn't get any glue into my main paint source. I used a cheap paintbrush to spread the glue and make sure to leave some thick and thin spots of glue. The different glue thicknesses will create large and small crackles in the final piece. Then while the glue is still wet, paint the chalk paint on top of it. Because Elmer's glue can dry relatively quickly, I recommend painting it in sections. I tested this with using chalk paint and acrylic paint on top of the glue and I found that the chalk paint simply crackled the best. If you are impatient like I am, you can use a hair dryer on low to speed up the drying process. The crackles will start to appear as the glue paint mixture starts to dry because the glue is shrinking as it's drying. Then you will simply finish adding glue and paint around your frame. It helps to have a small paintbrush on hand to fix up any weird crackles or to get any corners or little spots. I decided not to seal my frame, but if you are doing a larger project or one that would need sealing, you could try using a water-based poly to seal it. Let everything dry completely and add your artwork. I used watercolor paint to make a gradient and then I used my Cricut and some glitter for my inside seize the day. Keep smiling, keep crafting, and hit the subscribe button for more crafts.